Hello, my name is Ros Curtis and uh, thank you so much for listening to this presentation about St Margaret's Anglican Girls' School. St Margaret's Anglican Girls' School is 125 years old. It was started by an order of nuns uh, within the Anglican Church in 1895. And since then, we have been a prominent day and boarding school in Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. We have 1,080 students in the school. Approximately 750 of those are in our secondary school. And we also have 185 boarders. And our boarders come from all over Australia and of course, all over the world. We are in the suburb of Ascot. And with Ascot, um, it's a lovely, leafy, safe suburb in Brisbane. And we have many facilities on site. A sports precinct, a, um, a wonderful science and um, technology centre, library centre, year seven precinct. We have a swimming pool, water polo compliant and also heated. And we have a lot of facilities, even including a rock climbing wall. And I would welcome you to actually visit the school at some point, or at least take the virtual tour on our school website. In terms of our education, our mission at St Margaret's is very, very clear. We are focused on preparing confident, compassionate and capable women able to contribute to a global society. We have six core values in the school and the students themselves can speak about these values. They are uh, spirit, faith, courage, respect, passion, integrity. And in our strategic plan, we are focused on retaining our status within the Australian educational community as a leading school. And we do this by pursuing academic excellence, empowering young women, inspiring staff, broadening the horizons of our students and nurturing faith. Our school has a lot of academic success, not just by our own standards, but also by national standards. For example, the National Assessment Program in Literacy and Numeracy, we always uh, land within the first 10 to 15 uh, schools within the state of Queensland. For example, last year in Year 3 in that plan, we were the first school in, in Queensland. In Year 9, we were 6th, Year 7, we were 14th, and in Year 5, we were also 6th. Brisbane's top newspaper actually describes St Margaret's as the top primary school in Queensland and the ninth primary school in the secondary sector. However, we were the first all-girls boarding school. I think the most important statistic to quote to you about our academic success relates to outcomes for students. Where do our students go? Well, we know that 99% of our students when they leave us at the end of secondary school, undertake tertiary study. We have a lot of specialty programs at the school to support the students in a wide variety of activities. We have a flyers program where we provide academic extension as well as modified curriculum for those who are performing at an elite level in music or drama or the arts generally or in sport. We have an award-winning academic advising program, an award-winning um, uh, St Margaret's Plus program, and we also do what's known as continuous reporting, where you will know um, the results of your daughter's assessment within two weeks of them sitting um, that assessment, because you will be able to see the comments from the teachers. So we continuously report on student achievement. We also have an outstanding music program with 23 music ensembles and within the secondary school, 18 sports on offer. We have uh, student wellbeing programs, leadership development programs, community service groups within the school, and also a university preparation program for those wishing to sit 
for the SATs. We often refer to ourselves as a local school with a global outlook. And this is incredibly important to us. We have a diverse uh, student population and also we have a very well developed global exchange program where up to 30% of our year 10 students spend around about eight to 10 weeks overseas on exchange. And of course, we welcome into our school community um, our students from those schools that our students visit. And some of those schools include South Africa, England, New Zealand, America, Canada, Japan, Hong Kong, and Germany. The languages we offer at school are Mandarin and French. And of course, we have a very well-developed tour program as well. And many of these tours are taken overseas. Boarding is a very significant aspect of St. Margaret's and the student experience for St. Margaret's and we are open to boarders from year, years 5 to 12. Our facilities are modern with Wi-Fi, on-site chefs prepare meals and there's choices for meals and what is really important is we do have themed dinners uh, celebrating the international nature of our boarding house and also special cultural celebrations and also we have um, a, a residential program that also sits alongside the school in helping develop students leadership skills, organisation skills and also study skills. We do have the option for homestay, we have a relationship with the International Student Care Australia group called ISCA and they, um, some of our students will stay with school approved families. And next door to the school, when uh, your daughters may be interested in tertiary study in Brisbane, we also run a tertiary college or residential college for those studying at university. We are very committed to a healthy and quality student experience at St Margaret's. And there's a lot of support for students and particularly we have a pastoral care co coordinator in um, international uh, in, for international students. We also offer the conversational English club, uh, weekly international meetings with our coordinator, we have buddy lunches, international student outings, we also um, uh, participate in the Brisbane City Council student ambassador program. In terms of our um, international enrolments, we, we are delighted to be able to welcome you to the school and we have a number of subjects that will, appear to, um, will appeal to our students, particularly our English as a second language um, subject as well and of course uh, the support that they are provided by our um, international coordinator of pastoral care. So essentially, um, I really do invite you to consider St Margaret's as the school of choice for your daughter and more information can be found on our school website.